Oh, when you're lying in Zulu, when you're lying in Zulu, but without the first letter, yes. Uri me. So we're in front start now. We're gonna get the food. Is it recording? Yes. Um, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, we're on this medical campus now. We're about to leave and to go to another place to make it. We're excited for Northern Cape. <laughs> Are you excited for Northern Cape? Are you excited for Northern Cape? Yes, I can. Can't wait. <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am back with another vlog and I don't want to waste too much of your time explaining why I've been gone for so long because the only thing that matters is that I'm back and I'll be doing a lot better. For this vlog, I'm going to be taking you through two weeks of my life on a healthcare train. We're traveling by bus to the Northern Cape and we'll be living on a train for two whole weeks with final year students from all over the country. Our drive there was about 10 hours it took what felt like forever to get there and we only had two stops. Surprisingly, I only slept after six to seven hours of the drive. What are you buying? Isn't true. That cool cat cocaine. What cool cat cocaine. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. Why did they come up with the name? Coke. Coke. Where did it come from? Coke cocaine. Think about it. It's a good guy. At our first stop, we went to Steers and the garage just for a few snacks and food. We also had a bathroom break. That's better from savings. That's not savings. From savings. Violation. <laughs> So we're in Grandstadt now. We're gonna get food and, and we talk <laughs> and stuff like food that. and stuff. So guys, we're at the garage trying to buy drinks, but everything is 500 rand. It's pink with the long legs. Yes. What you were explaining when you're at Fushaga Marine? You, you, you were the one saying Fushaga Marine. Like oh my god. Yes. It's a group for the Korean anime. Oh, when you're lying in Zulu. When you're lying in Zulu. But without the first letter. Yes. <laughs> When you were the tents in the in the wild, oh, what it, yes, yes. Because you're not in it. Look on the side. W, you should be holding the auntie spike. I'm born. Oh. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's a video. Okay, hi guys. Welcome to Face Channel. Channel. Hi. <laughs> See, somewhere. We, yeah, we're in Bloomfontein now. Whoever. I don't trust them. No, we are. We are. I don't know. I, I don't the know. The receipt are. said so. We in Bloomfontein. <laughs> Is it Bloom? Yeah. Bloomfontein. Bloom. Keep Bloomfontein right now. But what if there's like Bloom Forest? <laughs> 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 Ah! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> wow! Forest. Blue forest! Meh. Oh, there we go. Meh. 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 Oh, there we go. Wow! Our trip was very long and tedious but we made the best of it um, by playing games and just getting to know each other as classmates. Um, we got to Northern Cape after 11pm and we had orientation. I didn't record that unfortunately, I was exhausted but this is what the train looks like outside and inside. I hope you're still enjoying the vlog because I'm going to take you through the rest of the two weeks. Say post mess bag. Post mess bag. What are you doing? We'd start our mornings by getting ready for work. We'd be up by half past five to be dressed and ready for breakfast at half past six. Getting ready on the train was far easier than back at home because of how warm the rooms were. That aircon was a lifesaver during the cold front. Time to Fitz Channel. Welcome to Fitz Channel. Um, hi guys, welcome to Fitz Channel. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Oh, thank you. <laughs> The highlights of my two weeks was without a doubt the food. Breakfast, lunch and dinner, the chefs showed up and showed off. Unfortunately, there were specific times set for meals which took some getting used to. But surprisingly, I adjusted well to the eating hours and never left unsatisfied. Our meals were in a buffet set up which I loved because it gave us a variety of food to choose from. The only time we didn't get options was if we were working on community outreaches where we'd have food delivered to us wherever we were working. We were blessed with the luxury of dessert every night and as a result I gained 3 whole kilograms. Before anything, we were given an orientation about the train, its rules and what was expected from us as nursing students. If I'm being honest, I stopped paying attention after about 30 minutes into the lecture. I was fighting demons to stay up. Um, after the lecture, we were given a trial run in the consulting rooms that we'd work in and that was the end of our first day. On days where we weren't working on the train, we travel around Northern Cape in a mobile clinic to different communities. Hi guys, um, so today is Tuesday and we have a community outreach. I don't know where we are at. We're in the middle of nowhere um, by the streets to see the community. Thank you. Oh, are you showing the streets? <laughs> it's giving me that? Yeah. yeah. We'd see anyone and everyone that would come to the mobile clinic, but we definitely prioritize pensioners. A lot of the patients we saw on these outreaches had arthritis, and honestly, it felt amazing knowing that I contributed to the relief of their pain. It's a video, it's not a picture. <laughs> To summarize my experience in Northern Cape 
and the train i would say that it was amazing i met so many different people from different backgrounds and i got an opportunity to touch up on my afrikaans skills i enjoyed every single day and every single minute that i was on it the work was not too much it was as if we were working in a normal clinic we'd knock off as early as 1 p.m. on some days and we'd have time to bond um, me and my classmates. I enjoyed the experience completely. I would definitely go back and I really hope that you enjoyed this vlog. I will be posting more consistently as of after this vlog on all my social media platforms so if you haven't already subscribe to my channel check out my social media follow like and comment morning guys so today is wednesday day three on the train and we are still going our dates today um we're sitting out right and uh, they've gone around to call members of the community to come um to the mobile clinic. Yeah.